And we have a little more snow still trying to work through the area. The last of it trying to push uh, mainly south of Pittsburgh right now. You can see uh, once you get from Washington County and I-70 through Manesson, it picks up in intensity as you get uh, uh, along I-70 there and then right into Greensburg, it lightens up a bit. A little, another little batch moving through northern Allegheny County. But generally, the snow is winding down and everything that is coming down is very light, but enough to stick to your windshield. You might have to pull out the uh, snow brush again one more time tomorrow. 26 degrees, calm wind, so not much of a wind chill because of that. And around our temperatures are generally in these mid to upper 20s. So it's cold. It's going to stay cold for a few more days, but we do have some warmer temperatures back in the forecast. So just know that once we get to the seven day, some of those days are going to start to look a little better. Snow showers still scattered around tomorrow morning, mainly south of Pittsburgh, and a lot of this is going to be that activity that gets pushed up the ridges. So as those winds push towards the ridges, it's going to squeeze out a few more snowflakes, but a couple of those uh, snowflakes may try to materialize in Pittsburgh. Generally, we're going to call it stray flakes. This isn't going to be anything that's going to cause any issues. Just a little light snow here, light snow there, and it should be all brief. Now, once we get into the weekend, cloudy skies around for Saturday. We'll break up those clouds a little bit come Sunday. So we'll see a, a few peaks of sunshine trying to work in there, but the warm weather, <laughs> the warmer weather doesn't start until next week. We're only going to get five degrees above average, which is 40 degrees. But once we get to the mid 40s, it's going to be 20 degrees warmer than what we've had for most of the forecast. So for your commute tomorrow, you might have a few random snowflakes in the morning. Generally, temperatures throughout the day hanging out in the mid to upper 20s will get close to 30 degrees for the afternoon. But I'm not anticipating any issues for either commute, especially on major roadways, because the snow that's coming down tonight is on the light side and expected to stay that way and wind down even more so. So a few light snow showers, 25 degrees, light winds for tonight. Then tomorrow. We're going to get those temperatures back to the low 30s. Cloudy skies around. Overall, a few snowflakes, but that's about it. There's not going to be a whole lot of activity going on here, and the winds are going to stay light east at 5 to 10, but that is enough to take those wind chills down to the 20s. And again, 40s average, so this is just another one of those cold days that we're going to be dealing with tomorrow. Your 7-day forecast. Now, this is the one that has some nice weather associated with it. Not a whole lot of nice weather, but any little bit we could use. Tomorrow, 32, few flakes, cloudy skies for the start of the weekend and some frigid temperatures there, especially early Sunday when we get down into the single digits. Monday, rain and snow, but this is meteorologically telling us some warmer air is trying to move in here. You can see we get up to 40 again on Tuesday, could have a few morning snowflakes there, but once we get into Wednesday, partly cloudy skies and with it right now, we're going in the direction of 45 degrees, so a nice Warmer setup, but again, that's only five degrees above average, but way above where we've been and way above where most of the first part of our forecast takes us. With all this going on, the KDK Weather app is available for free in your App Store and Google Play. Hourly forecast, daily forecast, interactive radar, and a whole lot more. And all you have to do is search CBS Pittsburgh.